do it with little bro mouth. Yeah. Play with us, we gun you down. Yeah, yeah this jacket is Dior. I remember being poor, talking about sleeping on the floor. Still a life from Georgia Power, mama could've went to jail. Now our house is big as hell. She don't do nothing, but I still pay her. Think I'm single, so these. What's good, YouTube? And I'm back again with another banger on game. On game. And I know I've been putting this video to the side for a minute, bruh. But I was been supposed to do this video. I remember when I did my last story time with the Walmart. Um, I think it was that video. I forgot what video it was, but I was asking, should I tell my uh, virginity story? Because every time I tell it, people be like, bruh, that's some wild, like, some wild shit. I don't be, I don't know. I was just hesitant on telling the story, you feel me? But now I really don't give a fuck. Cause I ain't gonna say no names on that. And this shit, I'm just gonna tell y'all the goddamn story. And the shit is low key crazy. So, <laughs> fuck it. I ain't, fuck it. I'm finally gonna make the video. Let's do it, goddamn. So, boom, 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 boom. I think I was like, I was a, matter of fact, I was a freshman in high school. Mind you, I ain't gonna lie, I always been a little grown, just a tad bit, just, 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 just a tad bit little grown, you feel me, like, I always been a little, little freak monster, little, little hornball when I was younger, you feel me, I was, I was, I was that, that kid, you feel me, no, I didn't did, I didn't did little shit, you feel me, a whole bunch of shit, so I just had never fucked no pussy, you feel me, I ain't, I had never just lost my virginity, but I was doing shit, if y'all know what I mean, you feel me. So my freshman year, I got dang on um, my freshman year of high school, but I'm gonna just say her name was Mary. I had a fucking little lamb, nigga. Her name was Mary, you feel me? And me and Mary was, we weren't even kicking it. Like, it wasn't even, it was just on some flirty, flirty, you feel me type of shit. But I already knew how she got down, you feel me? So, it was like that was at that time that was my attention. Now, ladies, forgive me. I was a young nigga. You feel me? I, I was a young nigga. I was just trying to get some coochie. I'm a freshman in goddamn high school. I'm trying to, feel me? I'm trying to get some coochie. But um, yeah. So I already knew how she got down. I already knew how she gave it up. I knew how she. You feel me? I had already you know her and this that and third. You feel me? So whole time I never told her that I was a virgin. What, what I look like telling you I'm a virgin? You think I don't know what I'm doing? You think you finna outdo me? Nah, that ain't work. That ain't how this finna go. You feel me? So I ain't telling her that I was a virgin. I was just, you know, going along with like, yeah, you feel me? You boosting it, you feel me? I, of course, I said I did other shit, but I just, you know, I was just lying about the whole not being a virgin. I was a young nigga, just chill. I was just chill. I was a young nigga. So look though, so I'm just chopping it up with her set. Uh, damn, get your words. So I'm chopping up with it. We go text them for a few days. You feel me? And then, boom. Uh, I got out of school. So, cause like the high school I was going to, we had two separate schools. So I, my school, we got out of school earlier. Like not like as far as day wise, but like year wise. If you get what I'm saying, like. Our school year started before theirs and ended before theirs, if that makes sense. It's like, awesome shit. So, like, we would start school in the beginning of August. Regular school wouldn't start school to the end of August. But we would still be in school together. It's just we started before them. Uh, we would get out of school, like, first week in May on some shit. And they would get out in, like, June. You feel me? So, boom. So, boom. Listen, hear me out. Hear me out. So, we get out of school. My 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 side of school. We get out of school. So I'm out of school. I done took my exams. I didn't did all that. Freshman year of high school. Freshman year of high school. I done took my exams. All that. So I'm still chopping it up with her. Mom, you see this? <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I apologize. But hey, I was a young nigga. You feel me? I'm grown now. It is over with. It didn't happen. You feel me? Boom. Forgive me. I'm sorry. But look. So boom, I'm at home, chilling. She's still at school, you feel me? You feel me? She's still at school. And um, she at this time, she taking exams. Because it's, it's about time for them like, to get out of school or whatever. You feel me? So she taking exams, blah, 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 all this other shit. 
And we text, I'm like, bro, we're like, come over after you exam. I'm like, I'm trying to go, um, I'm at home. I won't even, I don't think I was working then. Freshman, high school. No, I won't even work in there. I ain't start working until like my sophomore year. So yeah, I'm at, I'm at home all day, chilling, playing the game, bored. Dukes at work, bored. So I'm like, pull up, like pull up, pull up. Mind you, my mama was good for just popping up at home without telling nobody she was coming home. And I wouldn't know unless I hear her lock her car outside and I just look out the window and see, or she just open the door and come in. Also, mind you, we had just a thing on the door that you put on the door. So like, even if you unlock the door, you open it, you can't get in that motherfucker still. But she always used to tell me, don't put that on the door. You feel me? If I'm not home or I'm going to call you to let you know. If you do put it on, I'm going to call you to let you know, take it off. I was too nervous to even do that shit. I'm like, fuck that. So look, boom, back to the story. So I'm texting on girl. I'm like, bro, come over after your exam. Come chill with me. I'm trying to, I'm trying to get in there. No doubt. I'm trying to get in there. So boom, she like, cool, bet. Time for her to come over. She catch a Uber to the creek to my house. She catch a Uber to my house. When she get there, I'm like, yeah, nah. I can't even, not in, not in the crib. I can't even do it. Not nah, bro. Cause my mama walk in here, that's your ass and my ass. More so my ass too, but your ass too though. And I ain't going out, I ain't going out like that, bitch, bro. I ain't going out like that, bitch. I was, I was, I was, I was a rich, a risky ass nigga, but I want that risky. Bitch. My mama, she, nah, I won't, I won't play with my mama like that. Hell nah, hell nah. So look though, back to the story. So look, so boom, she pull up, gang. Guess where I take it to? The leasing office, nigga. <laughs> the fucking leasing office. So how our leasing office was, it was like, you know how normal leasing office is. The gym, you feel me? Leasing office, all this stuff. So the gym was it really, it was connected to the leasing office, but it was like outside the leasing office. But you could get to the gym through the leasing office too, if you make sense. And you get through it outside the leasing office. So there's two ways you can get in there. So look, gang, we pull up to the leasing office. Boom, we in there chilling on the equipment. Boom, chilling, thugging, you feel me? Just chopping it up. She like, I'm trying to fuck up. I'm like, Shh. in my head, I'm thinking like, damn, like, where the fuck, like, where, where I'm a fucker at? Like, me, like, where, where I'm gonna get like, down and dirty with her at? Me, like, I really, Jean? But look, um, I'm like, I genuinely, I don't know, like, how we gonna make this work, but I'm trying to get busy too. This is my first little cooch. You feel my first little time getting some cooch? She throwing it at me. I'm trying to catch it, duh. Feel me like, so boom. I'm like, like, we can do it right here. Like out in the open, mind you, all the blinds in the gym is open. It's I don't even I don't know if the camera in there or not. I, at that time, I didn't give a fuck. But I really, I don't know. But I know like all the blinds up, you can see straight in that bitch. The door was unlocked to like where you, where you come from, the leasing office to come to the gym. Like that door was unlocked all that. I didn't care. Boom, get in there, uh. Pull her pants down, boom. Hit, hit, uh, uh. Feel me, at first, I didn't really know what I was doing, so she had to help me. She I ain't gonna cap, she had to help a nigga out. I was a young nigga, you feel me? I was a young nigga, I ain't, you feel me? I ain't, yeah. So you had to help a nigga out, boom, ugh. So I'm in there, kill him. My first time, ugh, kill him, kill him, kill him. The whole time, my conscience, like, bro, what if somebody walk in here, like, while I'm here, bro? Like, like, the whole time, I just keep telling myself, like, what if somebody walk in here, what if somebody walk in here? I just, I was shook, bro. Like, I'm talking about, like, I was shook. So I'm hitting it, I'm hitting it. Find out, just take it out. I'm like, fuck that. Gang. It's two, it's two parts to this. One, I didn't know it. So, me not getting no pussy was on. I thought I nutted in her. On some wild shit, like I thought I did. Like I'm like, I'm, I'm pacing back and forth, walking back and forth, pacing, pacing. I'm like, what I'm gonna do, you gotta leave. You gotta leave, you gotta get over it. You gotta get over, you gotta leave. Like I'm telling her, like, you gotta go. Like you gotta get up out of here. Like I'm pacing back and forth, nigga. Pacing back and forth. And I'm sitting down on the uh, little exercise thing, like, damn, like what I'ma do? Like what I'ma do? 
thinking about it the whole time thinking I let it. So boom, that ain't that. Why as soon as we get done, like my conscious speaking to me, thinking it's money gonna come in, as soon as we get down, we boom, we pull up our pants, boom. Why as soon as we pull up our pants, the least of people walk in with a family trying to get them a tour. When I say my heart beat. I'm talking about beating. I'm thinking they didn't call the nigga. All oh, they see me on camera, all that shit. They open the door, they see me in there. She closed the door right there. So I'm like, I'm still sitting here the whole time. I'm still going through my head thinking I did it in this bitch. Like, you feel me? Like, still thinking I did it in her. Fuck that. I don't even give a fuck about Elisa. The they just, they adding on to it. So you feel my heart beat. So after she closed the door, I'm good. So then I'm just sitting there like, bruh. You gotta leave. I don't know how you gonna leave. You better call an Uber. You better call somebody to pick you up. You gotta get up out of here. I'm sorry. You gotta, you gotta get up out of here, Jay. Hey, I'm, I'm keep you. You gotta get up out of here. Nigga, she call an Uber. She leave, bro. Nigga, I get back to my, I get back to my, um, what's that shit called? My, uh, my, uh, my house. Then my gets back to my apartment. My dudes. Yeah, I'm in there calling all my niggas like, bro. I just got my first piece of pussy. I think I met him. It's like, they all like, what? And you like, what? Like, you all know how to feel when you met him and shit, bro. I'm like, bro, I don't know, bro. I don't know. I don't know, bro. I think I got this bitch pregnant. Da, da, da. Or oh, some other shit. I'm like, I'm talking about heartbeat. I'm, I, bro, I, can't, I, I can't even remember who I called, but I know I called like two or three people. Like, I think I called my nigga Mari. I think I called Vaughn. I think I called Lil. I can't, bro. I cannot remember. Bro. I know I called a couple people, bro. Like, I'm like, when I say beating nigga, I'm talking about cheap heart beating nigga. The whole time, this motherfucker texts me when she get back. I'm like, let me know when you get back to your destination. This motherfucker let me know. She texts me when she get back to her destination. So I she bleeding. Bitch, I'm already scared. Now you scaring me even more. Like, I'm talking about when she texts me now, I'm like, oh, um, what am I supposed to do? Like, what, what, what I'm supposed to do? Like, I don't know what the fuck to do. Like, I'm talking about my heart still beating. That's just adding on to the shit. Like, I don't know what to do. She like, bro, I don't think you are nothing in me. This I'm like, bro, I don't know if I did or not. You don't know. So how the fuck am I supposed to know? Fast forward, this motherfucker talking about she on birth control. So you mean to tell me? You had me in here pacing back and forth. Sweating. She didn't break. I'm talking about she didn't diarrhea, nigga. When I, bro, when I say I was scared, bro, I'm talking about scared, nigga. Calling my niggas. Like, you had me doing all this just for you to tell me. You on birth control? Then on top of that whole time, I didn't even nut in her. I'm just overthinking the shit. It was so much going through my head game between somebody walking in on us, me not knowing what I'm doing. They like, bro, it was just so much, bro. And I'm like, mind you, I didn't even have no condom. You feel me? Like, I didn't, one, I didn't plan on for her. Or two, well, not that day, I didn't. Or two, I ain't had nobody to buy me no condoms for her. I didn't really. Talk about it about my sex life. And three, I'm like, bro, this is my first piece of pussy. I'm trying to fuck bro. Like, okay. So, the whole time, she had a nigga scared for nothing. And I'm like, after that, bro, I would never, unless she my girl, I would never eat no girl, bro. Ever. Ever. You feel me? Never. After that, I never talked to her again. I'm talking about ever talked to her again. I mean, still to this day, like, I've never talked to her again. It's like, did you have me scared? You had me fucking party. I think that's like the most wildest place I done had shit. Just like, the leasing office. I don't know what was going through my fucking head. The leasing office exercise for a minute. I don't know what the fuck was going on through my head. But hey. I got some pussy. <laughs> That's all that matters. <laughs> you live and you learn, my nigga. You live and you learn. <laughs> you live and you learn. I never do some wild ass shit like that no more. Though. Especially when, of course, I'm growing out. But 
me thinking about it now, I was wild. I was just too happy to get some cookies. That was it. That shit was fucking it, bro. Damn. Now, I didn't, I ain't even gonna put my business out there, but I ain't, I ain't, I don't just be out here having sex no more. You know? I'm a loyal individual, you feel me? I like fucking one person. I don't like, you know, I know my shit too good just to be handing out. Now, back then, back in my day, maybe. Back in my younger days, maybe. Now, I'm too grown, man. I'm too wholesome of a nigga for that. But I got hella story times on like, like wow stories, feel like that that happened, bro. <laughs> Y'all would hear just feel me comment down below. But I finally did the video, man. I hope y'all enjoyed it. Make sure y'all like, comment, subscribe. I see y'all next video. Okay. Yeah, put a dub in little brother mouth. Yeah. Play with us, we going you down. Yeah, this jacket is Dior. I remember being poor. Talking about sleeping on the floor. Still in life from Georgia Power. Mama could've went to jail. Now her house is big as hell. She don't do nothing, but I still pay her.